Hey guys, this is Yo at the Hook and Hut, and behind me is Tiger, and he's he has he has been Tiger today. I put it I because of all the coyote that I've been eating my cats, I've lost seven, and I saw coyote take down one of the neighbor's cats in the barnyard here, and so anyways I reinforced the screen on my porch because I was trying to keep them from going off the porch and getting themselves eaten. And so anyways, he decides he wants to go through the screen. So I had to reinforce the screen and stick him back in the house. It's because he just, he doesn't get it. He knows the coyote is there. As soon as he steps off the porch, he looks right and at the barn to see if the coyote's standing there because that's where the coyote are coming from. And it's like, why do you want off, you idiot? So anyway, <sighs> sends his cap. So what am I doing this morning? Um, um, aside from being late, uh, I'm working on trying to finish up an order that my aunt placed for uh, three knit hats. And so anyways, I've been working on them in Heartland. Sorry, Lion Brands Heartland yarn. I'm not used to, sorry, this is all my HP uh, notebook. I'm not used to it. And that's why the pictures are faded out. The lighting on this thing is terrible, but what the heck. Uh, so anyways, I'm using Lion Brand Heartland yarn. And I love this. It's just so soft. And I'm doing them in, what is that, 149 Great Smoky Mountains. And of course, obviously, by the name, you know that it's in different shades of gray on it. And it's really beautiful. It's going to make a beautiful hat. And this one is 105 Glacier Bay. And oh, the blues in this thing. I just absolutely love it. And again, the same, same yarn. And but oh my goodness, I absolutely love the collars. And so, anyways, and the other one that I made, hold on, what was that? It was really pretty shades. It was King's Canyon, which was lovely shade browns. And so, anyways, so that's what I'm working on. It's going to be a fold over brim. So um, I would have done a reverse stock and a reverse. On a reverse knit stitch but I didn't because I don't I really don't like the reverse when I go to flip it up so anyway so it's just a uh, knit one pearl one going around and this one I don't know if I'm gonna add any pearls into the hat I think I'm just gonna make it a plain um, I think I'm gonna end up making it just a plain stockinette going around like I did when I made the um, Oh, I can't get used to this camera. Okay, like I did when I made the uh, uh, orange hat, which is, yeah, this is neon orange. Hard to believe with this camera, isn't it? This is neon reflective yarn by uh, Red Heart. But it's going to be that. Just probably just straight stocking it on the thing. Uh, so that's pretty much it. That's my day. Oh, and I've got a new, um, I've got a new sure hat design in the works so I'll be taking to some time off and giving my thumb a break uh, and working on it um, and stuff because I think that one's gonna be pretty neat and let's see oh yeah and there's something else I want to get done this week and that's this guy is he cute or what he's got he's got I've still got to put the zipper in Oh look, another end I didn't weave in. So I've got to put the zipper in this guy. And then he'll be set and he'll be going up in my shop before long. Hopefully. I know, every time I say before long it'll be months, won't it? But anyways, he'll be going up in my shop. And so I got him done. Another thing that I'm going to be putting up is the pattern for this little fella. And probably be a free pattern. I don't know. Probably most likely and anyways and then of course I've got the other pattern that I want to get out this week and put on Ravelry in my Etsy shop and that was the pattern for this because I really want to get this one up this was so simple if you've never done Fair Isle before this is such a simple one to l learn it with and so that's it for today that's I was sorry just looking around to see if I had anything else to show but that's it for today. Have a great one, and I will see you tomorrow.